Now we have two body. One is of square section. other is of suppose circular section on this body we have applied the force like this now the energy strain energy stored in both the systems would be same in this first case the strain energy that is u1 should be equal to i have to write 1 by 2 into sigma 1 then into epsilon 1 and into volume that is v1 in this case, this should be equal to 1 by 2 into sigma 2 into epsilon 2 into V2. This can be written as this sigma 1 square by 2 e into V1 or this is sigma 2 square by 2 e into V2. Now, both of these strain energy are same. It means this would be equal to sigma 1 square by 2 e then into this V1 will be equal to, so suppose the depth and width is same that is B and B at the diameter is D, this you have to write B square into L, in this case it should be equal to sigma 2 square by 2 E into this is pi by 4 into D square into L, in this case both are same it means U1 is equal to U2 means you have to write sigma 1 square into b square should be equal to sigma 2 square into pi by 4 into d square. Now, from here we can write <coughs> the sigma 1 square into b square is equal to sigma 2 square into pi by 4 d square. Now, since in this case the width was 50 mm, also diameter is 50 mm therefore this can be cancelled out therefore in case sigma 1 by sigma 2 if you want to find this would be under root pi by 4 this should be equal to 1.1413 therefore the answer should be c that is third option